All right, first off, welcome to the playoffs. This is something that not many people get to do. And when you think of the good teams, you know that they're in the playoffs every year, which has become you. But the other teams, there's a lot of teams that you know and your friends that are not doing anything tonight. And I commend you for being here. So number one is be proud of where you are. Number two, half the teams in the playoffs go home tonight. Half the team in the playoffs are one and done. And that's not you. It wasn't you last year, not gonna be you this year. We come on the road to Pahokee, this could be the Blue Devil. And all, for all I care, Pahokee Blue Devil, they played your female team at home. Who ended their season? Heritage. American Heritage. We'll come on the road and do it, or we'll end their season. Six and the seven after the first quarter, you know, we just came out because we were more talented and better than them, and we took them out of it early, but it was still one of our worst quarters that we played this season. Even though we were up 16 to seven, we didn't execute as far as all our offenses. They told me and Jay to go in there and play hard, rebound and blast shot, so I think so we did that. The second quarter, me and Eloy, we decided to just step it up and since it might have been our last game, just to leave it all on the court. And so we were both rebounding and blocking shots. Eloy had about 10 blocks. Trying to play high right now because this is the playoff. See, you lose, you go home. So I trying to go and still play and go for the championship. They gave it to Eloy on the on the block, so and I was at the high post. So when he went for the shot, I was going in for the rebound. I saw it was a miss, so I went up and just grabbed it and put it down. First off, that's the only time in my life I've ever seen one of our guys ten blocks and a half. Rely on the trees. Don't rely on the threes. Rely on the trees. Third quarter, um, we came out complacent. Everybody was really, I think we took them for granted because the first half we came out, we smacked them. So everybody took that for granted. Then they hit some threes, then they crowd got in it. And when they crowd got in it, they started hitting more threes. Like kids were just picking up loose balls, just shooting threes, and it was draining. So I just think the crowd got into the game because we were so complacent of how much it was up by. The other team took the lead, we just decided to step it up on defense, get our rebounds back and uh, just push it down the court for our points. We tried to slow down the game a little bit, but that didn't really work, so we just ran and scored. We were just attacking them and made them guard us instead of us being lackadaisical or letting them dictate what we wanted to do. We, we, we ran the ball at them, we got a couple easy layups and went, got to the free throw line and hit some free throws and the game was over. Starting tomorrow, your focus is on winning the regional semis. We played Pinecrest on Tuesday in the regional semifinals and I'm just trying to leave it all on the court so he can get this W and move on to get the first, be the first team to make the regional finals, then the first team to make states, first team to win states ever in American Heritage history. <laughs>